What up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Demilka Dream Young Baka. We are tuned into the Cup Full of H Town, Cup Full of H Town Tour, uh, special edition of B Side Four Man, Young Baka. DJ Ash and the one DJ Ash is a team player. She gave up a microphone, so make sure you guys follow her at What Up Ash. What up, and we in the up, building, Ash? man. What What's pop? What's pop? Let's introduce each other. Let's do it. What up? I'm Lego. Kick Rocks Entertainment, baby. Like kicking. Do rag Lego. Do rag Lego. Yeah. Yeah, you having a good day today? Yeah, I always have a good day if I'm alive. Awesome. Amen, buddy. Good answer. Always. Slum the resident. You already know what it is. Slizzy. Echo Park's finest. What's going on? It's Blur from Fort on April Fair. Got many names, but we're going to keep it going. <laughs> hey, yo, it's Young Casper, baby. Yeah. Sushi from 498 The Fam, Young Baka Production, all the good shit. Thank you to the beat side for having us. Uh, uh, let's get it going. Cup of H Town. You don't take your stick off your hat? Stick. stick on your hat. When you get a new hat, you, you don't take the stickers off? Oh, no. No, look, you, you don't take them off either? You got the barcode. Oh, there you go. That's dope, man. You keep, what if you have a tag? You leave a tag hanging? That's fresh, right? Like, depends on the hat, you know. I don't know. Uh, why do you leave tags in your clothes? Just because it, if it's a dope label, you leave it? Resell yeah, it, yeah, I respect resell that. it or return it. I respect <laughs> that. What were you going to say? There you go. We were talking about uh, how cold it's going to be in Houston. You said we've already dealt with this weather, which I don't think we have. I don't think I've ever been in 40, 45 degrees or less weather in my life. You're crazy, bro. In New York, in New York, the first time. So the first time we went, it was raining. It was super cold. No, yeah. No. The first time it was raining. The yeah, first time yeah, it was yeah, raining. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah, super yeah. hot. The first time, the first time we went, it was raining, raining, or whatever. The time. Okay. I don't know when it was, but I know the time that we went to the. Uh, it was the first time. time. The second time was super hot. Yeah. Okay. The third time. Okay, was the first time. The second time was super humid. Yeah. Okay. The third time windy was and cold. Yeah, yeah. The third time was when we went to a uh, um, uh, uh, heat maker studio. That was the third time. Second and third. All I know is that that shit was cold as fuck when we left that studio, bro. And I looked at my phone. Okay, was it? And, and, the, and the weather was, was it at Diamond Studio? The, uh, uh, yes, the di- yes, at, out, yes. Yeah, the upstairs of the Diamond Store? Yes, yeah, yeah. Manhattan. That Diamond Studio, yep. It was too cold, right? Too cold to smoke outside. Yeah. Um, so what do you think that was? How cold do you think it that was? was? It was I don't remember it being that cold, but I was also lit. It was 32 degrees. Bro. Yeah, I think it was. You looked but at your phone? Yeah, 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 I was yeah. looking like, at my phone one, at the weather, bro. One, two in the morning, right? It was like... Yeah, was, it was I, early in the morning, too. I was dying, bro, because I had a punk-ass Walgreens hoodie on. Yeah. And that fucking East Coast yeah. wind was killing my back, bro. Yeah, yeah. So, that, yeah, I'm not worried about Houston. No, I think, um... I think it's gonna get cold, like, our events. Our events gonna be over around that... Between 1 to 1, 2 o'clock a.m. in the morning... I think that right there is going to be cold because at that time, we're not really moving around. We're standing still, chilling, smoking, drinking, stuff like that. But um, I really believe that it's going to be super cold at that time. I'll put it up around I think it's going to be cold all day. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's going to be what? cold all day. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? No, we got oh, those scooters. We got those scooters. The electric ones? Yeah. The, yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, little, yeah. Little birds. Little birds. Look at Lego's face. He don't know uh, we fucking around. <laughs> uh, like, yo, 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 every time we travel, we always, if we do, like, if we can, New York, we don't have to. We usually, we always do. We always do, like, Lyft, Uber, and then we use the the city transportation. We always, those are the yeah. ones that we usually do. Um, but I think we learned from Canada situation. Because where the hotel and where the studio and where the fucking food was yeah. at, it was a journey. In, Can- in, in Canada, you had to go to districts. Different districts had different things. You had, the, you had District 7 was for the, what, or District 9 was for the food. Uh, where, uh, I'm sorry, where the studio. It was, the it studio was super organized. And 9 super and 7 was where like the food crazy. was. And 3 is where yeah. all the arts and shit was. So the you had to go to different, yeah, yeah, you had to go to different districts. And they um, drink some super water down. So, <laughs> what drinks did you have in Canada? I had a long island. Oh, okay, well that's probably why they, they, they <laughs> yeah. give the woman portion, you know. So it's a little different. Yo, and that, and, yo, in, that, in that restaurant, and you remember that's that very restaurant? Very yeah, 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 yeah. I know. I'm working on it. I am working on it. I'm working on it. Some of the stuff I say, I know. I'm getting myself wow. in trouble. I'm, I'm super excited. I think it's going to be a good trip. I think um, tomorrow we get to the show. We knock out the show. We do our quick interview. Um, hopefully these other artists show up so they can perform and get a pop in, and then we just head from there. Uh, I got a question. Did anybody look into transportation or parking? 
Like, how, how are you going to get to the airport tomorrow? You're going to drop you off at the airport? So, well, are you going to do the same thing? Have your girl? All right. So, I am I think I'm just going to get park my car at the airport and just That's what you do for Vegas, why, right? Yeah. How much is that? Just, I could come get you and we can go. No, because we have to. You got to perform uh, at the show. We have, we have a show tomorrow. Tattoo series. I can have her. Oh, okay. Take so, our show starts gotcha. at 6 o'clock. Starts at six o'clock, and after that we'll go. And also, I think that I'm gonna park my car at the airport. So when the when we're finished, get off the plane, I can go to my car and go home from there. Cause that night we're still supposed to get together and do another show that night. We're gonna be back here like at noon, 12, 12, 15, yeah. Cause we get two hours back. We leave. I believe we leave. What I just showed you is right here. Hold on, give me a second. We come back on Sunday. Shit, I was even thinking about pulling up to Venice on Ashes. And who, who drastic, 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 drastic. Ashes DJing at night. Drastic, drastic wonder, and uh, the OG Glenn gonna be holding down Venice. Okay. What up, Ash? And uh, Lego gonna be holding down uh, secret location in LA. Cup full of H Town finale, man. We're gonna celebrate the the two shows we in Houston. All the promo we did up to it, man. It's gonna be a great time. Full bar. Bartender super dope, man. She pours heavy drinks and uh, whatever else you want, depending on how nicely you ask. And it's gonna be dope, man. Live performances, we're gonna be popping, man. It's always a good time. We're all gonna be back from um, Houston. It's gonna be awesome, man. I'm excited, man. So tomorrow night, special cup full of H Town edition of the tattoo series, 6 p.m. Special start time, 6 p.m. Friday night, one Houston. Saturday afternoon, we have a whole bunch of promo, man. We just locked in one more radio interview as well. And then Saturday night, man, another show in Houston. We fly home. And if you're in LA, you want to go to Venice Beach, man, we're still going to be at Venice Beach. DJ Drastic, DJ Wonder going to be holding it down. And then Sunday night, man, cup full of H Town, the finale is going to be a party. I'm excited. I'm excited to go to Houston, man. You excited about Houston, Lego? Yes, sir. Excited. You sound really excited, man. What's, what are you looking forward to the most in Houston besides the women? Uh, uh, just being down south, man. I ain't been down south for a while. Easy, dude. Okay, you know I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, no, it's my oh, bad. I was thinking something else. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking oh, something yeah. else. That's I apologize. He's, he's, he's I apologize. I apologize. Oh, I apologize. Oh, that's on me. He, no, no, that's on yeah. me. I apologize. So he's just being in the yeah, south, right? Pause, he's south. always reaching. Pause. No, I got no. Because I'm just saying it's a Christian <laughs> show. You know what I'm saying? So we don't want to. Yeah, hey man, I've been baptized twice. Maybe two times a charm, man. So you, you for the people that don't know, you went to college in the south, right? Yeah. And what's the, what's the famous party that we always talk about? Freaknik. Freaknik. My boy Lego's at Freaknik, man. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, and because of fucking Lego, it's got shut down. Now, we, now it's over. Who so, knows? Yeah. Lego. Lego probably has that Lego back VHS. then? <laughs> I don't know, Lego walking around know with the big ass camera, right? That's right. What are you excited about the oh, most in man. Houston, Slump? He got the small camcorder on deck. Uh -huh. Yeah, he did. They don't know. Well, he he was mean, still in his, you know, in his pops nutsack. Good, good time. comeback. Good comeback, man. You know, yeah. I, I ain't well, trying to be. I'm just talking, man. Uh, Houston, oh, Houston, man. Uh, what am I most excited about? Houston, just, just, just the whole Houston culture itself. You know what I'm saying? The, 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 the candy paint. You know what I'm saying? With the '84s popping out and all of that. You know what I'm saying? The whole. The whole DJ screw screwed up, you know what I'm saying? That, that whole vibe, bro. I'm, I'm just we're gonna go ready to the, go uh, to the shop too. Yeah, 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 man. I fuck with Houston heavy, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I've, I've, I've always listened to Houston. Um, back when uh, like Paul Wall and Chameleon Air were doing mixtapes and shit, and like uh, um, uh, back when they were together, right? They yeah, were grouping yeah, yeah, and they yeah, split yeah. up. Yep. They, they, yeah, they were grouped. They, uh, um, screwed. Uh, uh, DJ Screw had like ESG and Lil Kiki and like so many fucking. Man, Houston got legends, bro. It's just crazy they never really pop. You know what I'm saying? But I think that a lot of them did pop, man. That 2005, 2006, oh, yeah, yeah, a lot yeah, of them really yeah, did yeah, pop. Yeah, but I mean, but what you're trying to say is like the little Kikis and the ESGs. Those cats never really yeah, pop. Yeah, yeah. It was it was uh, the Mike Jones and the yeah. Slim Thug yeah, and the Paul Walls. You know what I'm saying? Like, so and 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 the ESGs. A lot of quite a yeah, few. Yeah, right yeah, 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 yeah. There, there was one summer where every album I bought was Houston. Like oh, Slim yeah. Thug drop, then Paul Wall, and then yeah, Mike Jones and uh, Chameleon. The Chameleon album was is super underrated, man. Yeah, Chameleon is super dope, man. So you excited about the whole culture and everything like that, yeah, man? Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. Young, young, young buddy, what are you excited about the most, buddy? What am I excited about the most? Uh, honestly, I'm just excited to perform. 
uh, I could care less about what city I'm in. It's, 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 well, that's a good that's a good marketing. Uh, 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 if it's a stage, yeah, I, I just I just I like performing, so that's I always look forward to doing that. Like, I can't wait. You know, uh, I really I'm really excited to actually see everybody together again and on the road and see if I can make it. I, I got my money on going crazy. That's where my money's going. I think uh, we got a new, we got Casper coming along too. I think uh, that's going to push it on, push it up a little bit faster. So I'm excited, it's man. It's all, I, I get triggered. I get yo, triggered. yo. So, do we, do we? Uh, what do you think? You think yeah. it, I think it's going to be by Saturday afternoon. I think tomorrow after the show at the tattoo shop. On our way to the airport. Yeah, a little bit, a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Antoine, you know, usually on every trip, Antoine has like an explosion somewhere. You know, fuck it, I'm out of here. I'm done. Remember, he like got done and he went back to the yeah. back to the Airbnb one he's time. He's undefeated so far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So he usually goes a couple of days and then <laughs> uh, after a couple of days. <laughs> Yo, uh, you need to go to New York with us one time, right? Oh yeah, yeah. Philly in New York, right? The Philly, New York. Woo-hoo! That was crazy. So yeah. Some some almost exploded out there too. He threw yeah. a bill can at me uh, you, 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 because you, I said because I said he can't get another because he can't get another Philly cheesesteak. The problem is because we were drinking all day too, right? We were all yeah. pumping heads, man. Right. I swear to God. And plus, I heard, I heard. as soon as we got there, as soon as we got there, there was as soon as we got to the hotel in Philly, there was a fight. Number yeah. some chick called the cops on her boyfriend because she was beating the her fucking, ass. The fucking paramedics came like two, <laughs> like three units, bro. That that shit was nuts. They had to give the old, uh, old girl a ride. And she, they were like, where are you going? And she said, they, she said something. They were like, nope, we're just taking you. I don't know where they took her, bro, but they're up the street. Yeah, man. What day that was, was good that? Times, that was good times, man. That was good times. Philly was the first day, right? Hey. Philly was day one. Yeah, day yeah, one. yeah. So we watched, remember we watched the Eagles game and the Samuel Adams girls, they were giving out those free samples. Yeah, we got the stupid hats. I had a great time, man. I had a great time. It was awesome. And then remember we met uh, uh, Capone. Not Capone. Oh, uh, yeah. Capone. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the, at the spot, he was just yeah, chilling. Yeah, 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 yeah. My bad. I'm sorry. I apologize, lady. That's my I'll bad. I've been trying to teach him about it, but, you know, he... First of all, yeah, Casper, you ain't been here long enough to make fun of me. All right, that's number one. Yeah, <laughs> and, and then, Casper, what are you excited about Please. the most, man? You're excited, you're excited just to get out the house, right? Uh, yes, that too. You know, with all my 20 kids that I. Uh, I'm excited about the culture, you know. You know. <laughs> yeah. At, at the A1A the other day, so be actually say, how much kids do you have? I got this much kids. I used to have this much kids, but now I'm down to this. And she said, how does that happen? And she said, you're asking too much questions. Yeah, like, get story, out of my face. True story. No, I'm excited about the culture, you know, and also excited to perform obviously outside of California. Um, a couple of years ago, I did do South by Southwest, so I am aware of the area. And I remember someone mentioned the barbecue, so honestly, just to get out there, enjoy some good vibes, music, the culture. And, uh, you know, just rock with y'all. I know I'm the new blood here, but I'm excited to add my flavor to the recipe and build with y'all. And uh, just excited to branch out and, and get my music out with y'all, you know? How, how you been? What's the reception um, from you posting that you're going to go? You, people showing you love. Y'all are super dope. People saying, what are you doing? Is, is it a little bit of a mix of both? Uh, no, actually, it's been mostly positive now. You know? uh, especially, you know, uh, I mean, initially it probably was a surprise. But, uh... Yeah, of course, you know. Uh, um, and I got the US, last two. You know, and then we, we had talked about it, and then um, after calculating everything, I mean, I've always vibed with everybody great. You know, I have respect for everybody here. Um, it just felt right for me. The timing was awesome. And, uh, yeah, I'm just excited to get to work here and just build with everybody here. Um, so even if they had negative vibes, at this point in my life, I really don't give a uh, you know what I'm so, <laughs> I got an issue with you. I got an issue. How yeah. you you you're... you're you're in your thirties, right? Yeah. And you don't have a football team? Nah. That's crazy. Nah. I'm That's a little crazy. Yeah, kind of no. It, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you get a pass because of the type of life you've well, lived. A, you know I'm what I'm saying? I'm a basketball fan. I could talk that all day yeah. with anybody. But football, I know nothing. So yeah. You never had any inter- interest in football, you know? Can, can you grab a mic so I can hear you? They used to pick on you. Nah. Back in the day. Back in the day, I was a huge. This no, I don't know. You never know. No, 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 no. Slum. Don't listen to these guys. <laughs> niggas try to push. Niggas try to push football on me, but I chose pushing dope. But that's besides the point. I was a huge fucking. Uh, um, um, I was a huge 49er fan back in the day. Like 
back when you know when they had that when legacy. They were winning. When they were winning. Joe Montana, Jerry Rice, John Taylor, Roger Craig, all of them. You know, what I'm saying? yeah, but somebody doesn't have a football team. Yeah. Yeah, Shows. but 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 now now I just watch NFL like for the for the game. You know what I'm saying? Like I just like watching the you know the cool ass plays and and certain players and shit like that. I think I follow uh, players rather than the team. Fan. Nah, bro. Oh, Everyone nah. thinks you're a Raiders fan, anyways, I can't, right? I can't, Everyone I can't. thinks he's a Raiders fan, Who? dude. Yo. Like everybody. Everybody thinks who's a Raiders. That's your Raiders shout fan. Out, shout out Just the, the way you look. People I'm know you're not a Raiders fan. fan. I'm a Raider fan. I love the Raiders. I, 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 uh, yo, I'm a, have you seen? Yo, have you seen the new uh, Nevada license plate? Nah. The new license plate. It's all black with white letters with the uh, Raiders logo. So it has the Raiders logo. It's pitch black. Oh, so nice. white, right. Right. It's right. super hard. It's the hardest uh, license plate out. And you got the got Raiders. Yeah, a super crazy. Ash, didn't you play uh, semi-professional football? Oh yes. yes. What, what league were you in, Ash? Ash, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me let, before you answer that, Ash. We were watching. We, I sent the guys a uh, a clip of uh, female lingerie. Listen, no, 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 no. Hold on, Ash, I'm not finished no, yet. No, I was not finished yet. Female lingerie football tackle league, football, no. all right? Yeah, that, that's, that's old. All right? That's, that's been out it, for like 10 years. And check, okay. No, that's and not Ash, the And Ash, check this out. No, it's in the Baca WFA. Jumps, and Baca jumps in there no. and says, this is the league that Ash played in. I said, there's no. fucking no way that no. Ash is in that's, lingerie. I said, that's the league I didn't play in. <laughs> play that's tackling that's people. No. What league did you play in? The WFA. It's the Women's Football Association. Okay. There you go. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Ash. I'm going to ask for the mic back because that was not as exciting. I apologize. But we did have a conversation about that league before, right? Okay. So, uh, who's your football team? I was like, I said yeah, I, I'm glad we cleared that one up. Man. Who's this football team? It's the 49ers. Yeah, that one I know, but for the people watching, they might not know. What's your football team? It's the 49ers, guys. <laughs> oh, man. What's your football yeah. team, Barker? The Baltimore Ravens of Maryland, man. Ever since I was 10 years old, Ray Lewis got on camera. He said, if I hey, could... the team name if, again? If, if, the Baltimore Ravens of, <laughs> of Maryland. <laughs> Ray Lewis got on stage and he said, if I could overcome the things I overcame, you could do anything you want. And he was talking to me. Run that bias again one more time? Listen, motherfucker. First of all, <laughs> we're not going to talk about how you can hold down the show for seven minutes, okay? Yeah, okay. We weren't going to bring that up, but if you want to start, start talking, okay, we can Mr. start talking. Okay, man. Mr. Subtitle. There I'm you so go. Done. There you go. So now let's throw the question back at you. Um, what are you really uh, excited man, about Houston? I am excited about the food in Houston. I'm excited about going to Screwed Up Records, and I'm excited about the shows. I really am excited about the shows. Yeah, I think the shows are going to be dope. I think the shows are going to be amazing. Exciting. I think Friday night is going to be amazing. We're going to feel a lot of love. I'm going to show you how uh, to pay your dues. And it's going to be cool because uh, we're going to gonna be also celebrating the... Uh, the deluxe extra large Lego Nomics. Nomics. It's out. Please, uh, Houston, Houston, please get yourself a copy. Get yourself a couple of copies. If you get four copies, I'll pull up and sign it myself. Um, but we're gonna go there. I'm, I'm super excited. I'm super excited to have uh, Lego perform his new shit. It's funny, man. Yeah, I'm gonna sign it myself. You know what I mean? I know it. I know it. All right. So, but check it out. <laughs> Yo, but did you hear what I said? If you caught four of them, I'll pull up and sign it myself. <laughs> so you got to cop four of them for me uh, to, because I'm trying to help them out because Lego can't spell his name that many times, you know? Yeah. It's, a little, it's a little too much. Yeah, so, thank you, guys. All right. So I'm, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, so I'm excited. Really about that. Excited. I, I'm extremely excited about the food, man. No, I, I think the food is going to be I'm extremely delicious. excited about the food. Uh, I think it's going to be super cold. I think the events are going to be amazing, packed. Um, I think I think we're gonna see a lot of gold grills. Uh, I you think, think so? I think In 2020, so. I think 2021. So. I think so. And I think um, I think the slang. I'm super excited to hear the slang.